This is something you definitely don't want to try at home. We're near Zagreb in Croatia with Christian, Kresho and Zlatko. And what they're about to do is show off with some elementary chemistry. This is the best chemical reaction I've ever seen done in a fetal. To do it, you need some calcium carbide, some water, an oil drum, a man with a thumb, and your bit of newspaper on a stick. The first thing they did was get some highly reactive calcium carbide and mix it with water. Not a good idea. If we could see inside this oil drum, then what we would see is we would see these white rocks of calcium carbide reacting with the water and fizzing. And these bubbles being produced would be the acetylene gas. Acetylene is used in things like blow torches, and it's a really teeny tiny little chemical molecule, but actually it has got so much energy and power in it that when you do set fire to it, it releases all the energy in those chemical bombs in one go, producing all this energy and therefore a huge explosion. So we know what the ingredients are, but what were those crazy guys doing? One's jumping up and down on this barrel, and the other's got his thumb in it. As this acetylene gas is building up, you can see one of the guys jumping up and down on top of the oil barrel. And this makes the seal between the oil barrel and the ground much better. And you have another guy with his thumb on top of the hole, so you're building up a nice concentration of acetylene gas inside the drum. But why does this gas-filled barrel manage to get such epic airtime? They light the gas that's coming out of the hole, and this starts a fire that shoots inside the container. Now, the overall result of this force means that while all this gas wants to escape downwards, it can't escape quickly enough. Instead, the oil drum has to move to accommodate for all this gas wanting to quickly escape. Therefore, it shoots upwards into the air, creating this rocket. It's amazing. And incredibly dangerous. You have definitely been warned. 